I have owned plenty of different exotic animals throughout my short time on this earth. Now my main mission is to spread my knowledge on all these amazing creatures in hopes to better their lives in captivity as well as bettering our everyday life with them. I hope to encourage interest in creatures some may fear, as we as humans fear the unknown. One thing is for sure though, we will learn something new every day. Let's learn together. Welcome to Payton's Tarantulas. Hey guys, welcome to my channel or welcome back to my channel. So today I went to another reptile expo. I actually didn't get any footage of the actual reptile expo, um, mostly because I thought because I had been to so many reptile expos in the past couple of weeks, you guys were probably sick of seeing them. If you weren't sick of seeing them, I apologize. I just figured I would do something different and just not record at the actual show. Um, but I did have a couple of things that I picked up and I figured I would share those with you guys. Um, I picked up four things at this reptile expo, um, technically three things, but there's two of one. Um, so I did pick those things up and I'm going to share those with you guys. Um, this video is going to be really short, just me kind of showing you what I got at the reptile expo. It's going to be a very short video. Um, but I am going to be doing some setup videos for these creatures and I will definitely be recording that and showing you guys. So please stay tuned for that because that one of those videos is actually probably going to go up tomorrow. Um, so keep your eye posted for that. Let's get right into what I got at this show. So first up is something that I've wanted for a long time and the opportunity arose and I got two of them. Um, I am obsessed with soft shell turtles uh, and these little guys are Florida soft shells. Do you see how long their necks are? And they are just beautiful. They are way too small to tell, but I did my absolute best on guessing male and female. I think this one is a female and I think the other one is a male. Um, this one that I believe is a female is going to be named Mushu. Um, so I already picked out a name for them. Uh, Mushu is the female. I have a little quarantine set up behind me. I'm actually going to transfer them into from their travel cups. Um, so Mushu can go right on in and swim in the water. And then this guy here, this one I believe is a male. Um, also just the most adorable thing. Like, let's see if it'll focus. Come on, focus. Like, it's not focusing very well, but just they're adorable little snouts. Um, they just have these long little snorkel like noses. So this one is actually going to be named Norman. Um, he is what I believe to be a male. So we have Mushu and Norman. So I'm going to go ahead and put Norman in there. Come on, Norman, go swim. All right. So Mushu and Norman. They're going to be housed together very temporarily just until they get to be a couple inches larger and then they will actually go in separate tanks. Um, turtles do not get along. It's not necessarily good to keep turtles together, um, but because they are so young, I can get away with it for now. Um, so they're just going to be housed for probably just a couple of months until they get bigger, um, but they'll be housed together for now and then they will go into separate enclosures. But I am going to post a video of me setting up their enclosure because soft shell turtles are actually completely different than every other turtle species and they require just a little bit more care and dedication. So I'm actually going to be posting a video of me setting up their enclosure and talking about them a little bit. But we'll get right into the next two things I got. First up is this gal here, both of these are females. Um, I got this female um, metallic pink toe or avicularia metallica. Uh, you can't see her very well in this cup. She'll be getting rehoused. That'll also be another video. Um, I do not have a name for her, so if you have any name suggestions, put them in the comments. 
um, because I would like to get her name. And then also we have this gal that I got as a complete score. Uh, this is a female uh, curly hair and she, I got, they actually gave me the Critter Keeper and everything that she was in um, and the female tarantula and she was only $25. Um, and the guy actually gave her to us for $20. So she was actually a really good deal. Um, and so I picked her up as well. She also does not have a name. So please leave name suggestions for her in the comments as well. Um, I'm going to see if I can actually get some better footage of her since she's already in here. Uh, my pink toe is just like chilling on the top. So I don't know if I'm going to be able to get good footage of her. But I will try and add that in at the end of this video um, just as like a little bonus ending. But yeah, those were my pickups from this Reptile Expo. I hope you guys enjoyed. Um, like I said, if you have any name suggestions for my curly hair or my pink toe, go ahead and put those down in the comments below. Um, I actually, I'm trying to build my collection back up. I know I've said that before in other videos. I'm trying to build my collection back up. And I initially was starting with some tarantulas that I'd never owned before, even when I did have my big collection. Um, but one, curly hairs are just a must have, I feel like in every collection. I love curly hairs. And two, I did have an avicularia avicularia which now I don't even think that's the scientific name. I think they actually changed that. Um, but I've been out of the hobby for so long that I can't remember. Um, but I never had an Avicularia metallica. So this is actually a different species of Avicularia than what I have previously owned. Um, so I'm pretty excited to own these gals. So yeah, I will show you some bonus footage of hopefully both the tarantulas, but maybe just one. Thank you guys so, 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 so much for watching. You guys watching is what helps feed my animal addiction. Um, so thank you guys so, so much for watching. Uh, don't forget to like this video, subscribe to my channel if you have not already, hit that little post notification bell so you never miss out on any future uploads, and stay tuned for tomorrow's turtle setup video. Bye guys.